Hi, my name's Mr Cockrell and I'm Head of English here at Boroughbridge High School. We wanted to tell you a bit about our department, to let you see some of our students at work and give you an insight into what they do in class. And we also wanted to tell you a bit about our curriculum and the fantastic range of things that you learn when you're in English at Boroughbridge. At Boroughbridge, we have a thematically structured curriculum. This is a culturally rich, immersive learning experience that insists on English being something more profound than exam preparation, while making sure students are prepared and confident for their GCSEs. Year 7 students begin the year with Telling Tales, a study of narrative archetypes, setting, character and fairy tale, focused around Philip Pullman's Clockwork and William Shakespeare's Macbeth. Moving on to Journeys of Discovery, students study a range of forms of travel writing, including literary non-fiction, blog, and advertisement. They then study the codes and conventions of the adventure genre as they work on creative writing. The year concludes with the theme of growing up. We study David Armand's The Fire Eaters, as well as a range of drama and poetry that explores this theme. In year eight, we read John Steinbeck's classic of Mice and Men and learn how the author presents marginalized people's struggle for survival. We then explore this theme in the context of the wilderness, looking at how writers depict our attempts to live in hostile and difficult environments. Under the theme Imagining the Future, students then tackle creative representations of apocalypse, working on an immersive creative writing project and reading Robert Swindle's novel Brother in the Land. We finish the year studying visionaries, considering how language can be used powerfully in both the spoken and written form to convey thoughts and generate change, as well as reading the work of the romantic poets. In Year 9, we consider the supernatural, reading legendary folk tales focused on monsters both ancient and urban, before getting seasonal prior to Christmas by studying Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol. The spring term sees students considering the notion of outsiders, reading literature from different cultures and traditions, as well as prose that explores life on the outside of power and privilege. We conclude by transitioning students into GCSE by studying subversion and rebellion, Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet, and aspects of the Gothic. We use lots of modelling and scaffolding in our teaching, so we're showing students how they can become better writers. Students spend time looking at their own writing and making improvements and editing their work, and we provide differentiation with toolkits, writing frames, and individual help when students need it. My teachers help me become a better writer. The English teachers are really nice. They help me a lot. I published some of my writing on the English department's writing blog. That was really exciting. We do lots of interesting topics in English. It's never boring. We like to think of our students as apprentices in the disciplines of reading and writing. We use lots of visuals to help them to structure their thoughts and ideas and to turn those ideas into texts. We integrate where we can the teaching of literature and language so we can remove imposed boundaries around reading and writing. There's lots of really good discussions in class. The teachers and teaching assistants help me work out things to get started. If you're stuck, there is always someone to help. 